What's going on guys? Drones and Dogs here. Welcome back to the channel. If you don't know guys, well you gon' know. We got another smooth unboxing for you guys here today. Before we get into this unboxing, man, I want to say real quickly, if this is your first time coming to the channel, if you happen to just scroll past, we're looking at some RC videos, and you happen to come across my video, let me tell you, you're missing out. You need to go ahead and click that notification bell. Go ahead and subscribe. I guarantee, I'm going to just tell you right now. Just go ahead and subscribe, click the notification bell, and I guarantee you, when you start seeing my videos and you start, you just go look at some of my older videos, I guarantee you, you're going to like what you see. Even if you don't like the drone, you're going to at least enjoy some good content. You're going to at least enjoy some good RC videos that I've been pushing out for you guys. And I keep all of my subscribers plenty happy. And I want to thank each and every one of you guys from the bottom of my heart for rocking with me. And you already know, man, I got way more content on the way. Nice unboxings like this stuff right here, man. I'm going to be unboxing right here. This is a real cool looking little drone I'm going to be showing you guys here today. So stay tuned, guys. Subscribe, click the notification bell, because it's going down. <sighs> All right, guys, so what we got here for you today, man, is a really cool looking two-in-one, guys. It's a two-in-one mini drone by this uh, company called Broad, Broad Dream. Hope I'm saying it right. Broad Dream, Broad Dream, Broad Dream, or something like that. Anyways, it's a two-in-one stunt board. Now, I have seen something like this, and I'm thinking this is just a rebrand. I have seen the, uh, something like this by Ishin. It was like the Ishin E019, and it was exactly like this. But their, their little action figure was a guy, and I thought it was really cool that Broad Dream had enough imagination that they went with the little woman action figure. Because usually when you get action figures with stuff like that, with these little uh, novelty toys and drones and stuff, is usually a guy. Raw Dream, they actually use a woman. So shout out to our women RC pilots out there and our uh, women hobby enthusiasts out there too. I see y'all too, you know what I'm saying? You know, so that's cool that they actually use a little woman. You can get it in red or blue, I got red. You know, you guys know usually I typically get blue, that's my favorite color, but I decided to go ahead and switch it up so I got red this time. Just to have a little, uh, little something different, you know? And it's really cool, it's an RC stunt board and paragliders, two in one, so it rides it actually rides on the little board and then it you can also transform it into like a little little uh paraglider so it's a two in one flyer you know what i might do it do like a two-part review after this this is going to be the unboxing but i might do the review in like a two-part i'm not sure man i might do like a part one where i just do the paraglider or do the stunt board and do a part two where i do the other one we'll see we'll see but it's the broad dream stunt board rated rated ages 14 plus Extreme sports stunts, man. Two in one. RC stunt board and paraglider, man. Guys, another reason why you should be subscribed to the channel. If any of my subscribe, all of my subscribers that have been following you, following me for a while, they would tell you, I be hitting you guys with the exclusives, the bangers, and this little thing here was less than thirteen bucks. It was like twelve ninety nine, guys. Yes, twelve ninety nine. Very very cheap. Very, very cheap, and it's really cool. Look at it. I mean, I hope it flies well. So, I mean, the reviews I've seen on them, they fly pretty well. So, I'm excited to unbox this guy and show this because I love showing you guys good content and cheap content, cheap content that you guys can be able to enjoy with your family. Everything that's in the RC hobby ain't gotta be expensive, guys. You guys gotta have some good fun for cheap. You know what I'm saying? And that's what I'm all about, you know? So let's go ahead and get into this, man. Too much jabber jar. No, I don't want to have y'all waiting too long, you know. I don't have y'all waiting too long. You know. Get into this, man. I am so excited to get into this, guys. How about you guys excited? Yeah, man. 12 bucks, guys. So right away, here is the little... Ooh, ooh, everything's falling out. The little paraglider thing is like taped into the top. This is the little parachute paraglider thing here. Actually taped up top. Let me get that out since it's like dangling. Dang, dang, dangling. Ah. All right. So here is like the little paraglider part. This tape is like really stuck to here. 
Ah, I don't want to rip it or nothing. All right, stick that there. So here's a little paraglider part that will actually go over the little quadcopter when you're uh, using it as a paraglider and stuff like that. Everything else kind of just fell out that you dig, you know. I'm gonna leave that right there so you guys get some little artwork to look at. Have a little goodie bag that fell out. Instruction manual, of course. Two axis drone, it says. Yes, guys, this is actually a drone. Check it out. Instruction manual. Seems like you got some Chinese going on and then you got some English going on. English and Chinese, you know, so. Fairly legible, you know how this goes. You guys read that. Um, this is so cool, guys. So look at this. It's locked in by these little, like, little notches here on top of the drone. There is an on and off switch in the back of the drone. And there actually is four propellers, guys. There's one prop here, one prop underneath, one prop here, one prop underneath there. And there, there's actually some, there's an LED too. There's an LED up front here. And there's an on and off switch in the back, so... See if I can turn this guy on. I can't turn it on, it ain't on. It, it was already in the on position, so. Yep. And I think you get two batteries with it. I'm not sure. And I think they're non-proprietary batteries. Give me a minute. I'm trying to figure it out, guys. It has a little latch that opens and says. So if I pull this little latch open. Yeah, look at that. Nice. Nice. So there's a battery in here, and I can see there's a battery in here. So yeah, it comes with two batteries and they're the micro low C connector, guys. You guys know I like the micro low C connector batteries because those are my favorite because they're non-proprietary, they're cheap, and they work they work well. I mean, so that's pretty good. If I can get this little thing out, it'll be all right, you know. If I can get this little dude out, it is really snug in there, guys. That's another, that's one thing. I can't, it's a little, I'm trying to see what it is. This thing is it's in there really snug. Come on, guy. Come on out. Don't make me break you. Oh, yeah. That thing fits in there really snug, guys, for me to try to get that out. Are you serious? Dude. I'm gonna end up breaking the guy on the first rip. Yeah, that's a real snug fit for that battery to come out, guys. I don't wanna have to break it. So we'll just go ahead and take a look at the other battery that, that's inside here. Cause, and then I'll be able to fiddle with that a little bit more off camera. Cause I don't wanna sit here and fit it, fidget with that. But the battery does go in underneath there, you guys. And it's a micro low C connector. If I had to guess right off bat, I would, I would probably say it's a little, maybe a 150 milliamp hour battery. It's a very tiny battery, but this little compartment is so small, guys. I, it's snug to get it out. And here's the little action figure, the little woman, and she actually moves. She can move her arms and stuff, move her head. So she's functional. Check that out. We're going to set her there like that. And look at the goodie bag so we can actually get a a look and see what size this battery is. We're just gonna dump the contents out here. See what we got. So here is the little string. This is you're gonna attach this string to your paraglider, and she hangs from the paraglider underneath the drone. Okay, and you'll see that all in the review, guys. When we get this guy outside for a flight, or this girl outside for a flight, I should say. Four extra propellers there, of course. USB charger. And the side, here's the battery for this guy. The size of it is, oh, it's a 300. It's actually a 300 milliamp hour battery. That's, that's a small. I thought it was like more like a 180 or something like that. That's actually a 300. Wow. Pretty decent. So we got a transmitter here. Small, really nice, but it feels pretty decent. On and off switch, automatic takeoff buttons, trim buttons here on the face of it. It has a demo button here. Looks like it has a, a 360 flip button, so she flips. Um, not really sure with these buttons here, maybe a one key return, yeah, one key return and a um, emergency shut off button. Really nice, take off landing, power buttons, trim buttons, joysticks, 
we have a little battery bay back here. I'm pretty sure it's gonna be some AA, I mean, AAA batteries with that small little compartment, probably two or three. And of course, the screwdriver, guys. So we are all good to go. Let's go ahead and get this lady charged up. And like I said, click the notification bell, subscribe, and you're gonna see this girl fly. She looks pretty cool, don't she? Yeah, yes yeah, she does. The stunt board, man. This is the stunt board, the two-in-one bra dream. Let's get it. Bow. Catch you guys in the next video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I am out. Deuces.